Hello, I am Nick Miller, a technical service advisor at Synagon. Today, I am at our Minneapolis Pharma Solid Lab, and I'll be talking about our slug testing kit. Why do we slug test? Slug testing is the best way to accurately determine the proper height of a dosing disc for capsule filling machines. This is important because proper disc height will affect fill accuracy. A properly sized disc will increase your product yields. Not only will a slug tester determine dosing disc height, but it can also be used for R&D purposes during formulation of your product, for example, when to add excipients or binding agents. This will assist in making sure your product forms a proper slug. Products that form a proper slug will produce higher yields than those that do not. Included in the kit is a slug tester and size 5 to 000 compression pins and dies. After powering on the slug tester, Select your pin and die based on your capsule size. First, thread your pin into your slug tester. Place the die holding plate and then your die onto the plate. Before we can begin our test, we must zero the force and the length. To zero the force, simply press the zero force button on the control panel. To zero the length, you must put 250 newtons of force onto the plate. To do this, Turn the hand wheel until you see 250 newtons displayed on the control panel and then press the zero length button. Once the length is zeroed, turn the hand wheel to move the pin back up and lock it into place by tightening the resistance handle screw. Once the slug tester is zeroed, you can now pour your pre-measured product into the die. If your product does not flow well into the die, use a small brass rod to slightly tap your die and allow the product to flow into the bore. Once this has been done, you can now begin your slug test. We recommend performing three slug tests on your product. During these slug tests, you should compress your product to 30, 40, and 50 newtons of force while recording the slug height at each increment on the included slug table sheet. At each increment, we recommend pushing the slug out of the die and testing for slug formation. Slug formation is important because this will determine at what force we take our average to determine our disc height. If you push your product out of the die at 50 newtons of force and it has not formed a slug, we recommend performing additional tests at higher compression rates up to 120 newtons of force. You may find that not all products form slugs. For this example, our product formed a proper slug at 40 newtons of force. Therefore, we take the average of our three tests at 40 newtons, which is 15.4 millimeters. This is our disc height. Thank you for joining us today for our slug tester review. If you would like more information, please contact your area sales manager or your customer support representative.